morning guys from Gir here. We have already started our return trip towards Bangalore. So today we plan to hit Baruj, which is around 480 kilometers from here. And it's around 7.15 in the morning right now. Our host, Mr. Savdas, was really kind enough to make us tea this early in the morning. And it got us all set for the long road ahead. So we'll be crossing Amreli, then hitting Anand, and from Anand to Baruch. It's quite early and it's chilly, but we are well prepared. The rain covers do a wonderful job of protecting you from the wind, the chilly wind actually. And today also we both have worn double socks, one on top of the other and it's much more comfortable. We did not manage to see, as Nidha Master told you, any lions uh, in the actual wild. So we took the safari. Just by five minutes we missed it. A safari vehicle, a gypsy, just ahead of us, they spotted two lioness and I think cubs. But then our day was made by a group of uh, tourists who mistook a Neil guy to be a Unicorn. They actually believed that the Nilgai was unicorn until one of them confused them by saying that unicorn has only one horn and this must be something else. So <laughs> our day was well made yesterday. Thankfully we were wearing balkavas so they could not see us laugh and all. Otherwise it would be really impolite. But it's funny. Left and I escape at left. Okay. Yes, you can align it. I will be lega. Rasta China. Channel for Chala, 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 The thing with Google is whenever you put two-wheeler road, the crazy thing is it will show you the shortest route every time. Doesn't care if it's off-road or anything, but it will show you the shortest route. So there is a left turn somewhere just here in the corner. Yeah. We got the left. Uh, canal ko follow karo, that's what uh, the villager had told us. So this is like proper off-road now. It's all gravel, riding really slow, being careful. It's nice man, we would not get this view on the road, but <laughs> on the highway most probably. So, pretty nice to pass by, take everything in your stride, be happy while riding. Yeah, nice gravels, huh? As if I'm floating on them. Oi! Oi, 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 oi. Oh no, that car is blowing dust to the wind. Now that's not good. Not a pretty sight. Close your helmets. Wow, what range is that, honey? Can you take from uh, short? I think that is the Junagar Hills. So the Junagar hills are looking pretty awesome there to my right. Just below that hills uh, is Junagar town. Tea 
selling tea and biscuit. That's it. That was our breakfast today. Biscuits, Monaco. I would just like to state one more thing. Like there is a punchline about Gujarat tourism. Kuch nahi dekha to kuch nahi dekha. But we would like to state like Kati Wadi nahi khaya to kuch nahi khaya. Gujarat mein aao aur Kati Wadi sure khao. So it's vegetarian. It's like really really tasty and awesome. And I hope my voice is clear because it's really windy. So I'm not riding fast at all. And we are having some issues with the speedometer, it's uh, stuck. We really enjoy passing through this kind of roads. Any biker would enjoy actually, not only us. Uh, it's much more... There is much more to see and experience than on the highway and this is one of the most important reasons that we ride is to experience the place. The highways don't uh, always give you that opportunity but this kind of interior roads always do. There are a lot of black bugs here. There was a board which states that uh, we would be lucky to see some. I need a scarecrow after what you did. Cause all of the birds know that I'm almost dead. I'm barely breathing. So guys, I'll be really silent and try to show you some deers which are here and black, uh, particularly black bucks, they are there in this place. I think we scared them off. They were feeding just next to us. Crazy feeling. This is a black buck national park. Actually for the first time I have seen any black buck in the wild. So in Karnataka there is Rani Binnur, we have never visited it. Never got the chance to visit it actually. So I guess we'll not be able to show you guys. We'll try, we'll try. Oh, wake me up. Not in this century. Don't wake me up. Cause you're just a ghost inside my head. You're just a ghost, you never did. You're just a memory on my lips. Cause you're just a ghost inside my head. 
small tea break with some bonda kind of things. I am not sure what it is. Uh, we are on Highway 228. National Highway that is. Uh, doing the uh, last 80 kilometers to Baruch. It's uh, already past 5 o'clock. My suggestion to anybody, our suggestion to anybody visiting Gujarat would be stick to the main national highways. Those are well maintained and really nice to ride because in Gujarat you would be mostly making uh, the miles and going from one point to another because in between there is nothing much to see. Uh, unlike us. <laughs> so we are learning from our mistakes. As you can see, we, had, uh, we have taken a detour as suggested by Google just before reaching Baruch. And what a detour it is, man. It's just getting us relaxed before we reach uh, our destination for today. Uh, because as I said earlier, blah, 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 the highway was not good at all. <laughs> but the detour is make, getting both of us really, really calm and relaxed. And we are just enjoying the view. The sun is about to set there on our right side. And the road is pretty empty. It's uh, some uh, interior road passing through some villages. The air is so clean, man. Like, uh... Also, I think uh, we will end the vlog today from this road itself because uh, we want to reach the hotel have our dinner and just crash because tomorrow again we will have a long long ride and it will be a good night from me and Snitha here as we ride towards Baruch. Hope you guys have a great great week or a weekend whenever I am uploading. <laughs> and we will leave you with the beautiful shot of this road as the sun sets through the countryside in Gujarat. Not in this century